YouTube. My name is Zach Sensorman. and welcome to the channel. So, we are stopped here at QT. You know, my favorite place to go. You know, gotta start off with that quality breakfast. Man, if y'all haven't had these things, are amazing. And then, of course, bang. Anyways, so today we are headed out to Bailey's High Performance. It is Dino Day for DFW LX. I'm actually right across the street from a pre meet meeting up with a couple buddies and we're gonna roll out together so i think there's about 25 cars getting dynoed i can't get footage for all of them because it would just be an extremely long video so i might get some of the highlights of course i'm gonna have my car so we can finally see what my car actually puts to the ground figure out the equation for drivetrain loss see about what i make it to crank so that should be fun we are going to head across the street, go meet up at Target, meet up with Chris, Hunter, and some other people. And, man, we're just going to get this day started. All right? See you guys in a few. So there only ended up being four of us at the pre-meet. So there ended up only being four of us showing up for the pre-meet. Hunter, you didn't show up. This was your idea. You're number one on the dyno list. Hope you make it in time. So it was just too damn cold out there. I mean, come on. It's 39 degrees. It's Texas, man. Like, that's cold. I'm going to do this 39 degree stuff. Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> well, there's two of the guys right there that showed up. Chris and Randy. I've got one more person behind me, but we are rolling out. We're gonna go and uh, get parked, get situated up at Bailey's and wait for everybody else to show up. There's another caravan rolling in right now, or they should actually be leaving their location in about 10 minutes. So we should all show up about the same time. Man, what you guys think I'm gonna run on Dino? pretty much know what I'm gonna run but hopefully the car surprises me I don't know we'll see guys I'll check in when we get there get some uh see what all cars are there should be a good day caravan showing up hey you go Chris tell him where to go I'm not the only one <laughs> oh that's funny What's going on, Corey? What's going on? Hey, Chris, you want to go get a Hi. So, we're going to let everybody park while everybody's getting situated. Whew, love this car. I'm going to go in here and uh, see if I can get some footage.
bring the car up here. Drew will take over, drive it on the dyno. We'll get it strapped down. After we're done, we'll give you the dyno sheet, back it up here, and then you can take it and park it. So kind of, the, the faster we can move through it, the faster we have, and if there's any other questions you guys need on anything, um, let us know after the, the dyno results, we'll be able to help you. <laughs> Sounds great, looks great. I'm happy with it. Uh, of course, he's gonna be doing more stuff, so we'll see. Let's see, I think I'm number 12. Everybody's over here, like looking at him. What's up? So, we got Chris and Chris. That was the Chris and Chris that raced earlier. Um, so, Chris won one of them, but I'm gonna have to pick and choose what cars I'm throwing on here for footage wise. I know I got a lot of 300 subscribers, so we're gonna do more 300 content and everything. I might post the highest dyno car, you know, just some other real nice cars. But like I said, there's like 25 cars going on today. I can't put all of them on. Hope you guys enjoy the footage. You know, gotta get the next car up. It's gonna be a little bit here and there. Uh, as far as taking car off, putting a car on, I'll try to interview some people, see what they got done to the car, see all those things, and then we'll just go from there. finally gone through 11 cars so I am next number 12 I recorded as many of them as I could had to put the phone on the charger because I needed to make sure I at least had battery to record my own car because what's the point of doing a vlog if you don't record your own car so moment of truth we're gonna see what my numbers are I got a rough estimate of what I think they are especially after watching some of these other cars already go so next cars moving Let's see what this does
Alright guys, so we got my numbers. Now it's uh not what I thought it was gonna be. I actually made more horsepower than I thought and less torque, which is interesting. So I made 444 horsepower and 420 torque. So I'm happy with those numbers. I uh Really thought the torque was going to be higher, so I'm going to have to ask Chris about that and see what's might have been that issue. But I'm happy with the numbers. That uh, that puts me over 500 crank. Happy. So Chris with the old Gladiator over here. I done put my car on the dyno, now he wants to do it. And my sounds good. So now we're going to compare yours. So basically you have <laughs> the same mods done. Intake exhaust on a 392. So we're going to see if it's just the temperature, the air. We're going to figure out what this car does compared to my 300 so that we have a rough idea of what's going on. Because I made way more horsepower than I thought, but I made less torque than I thought. So I don't know what's going on. Whatever. Alright. Well, let's see what Chris does over here, trying to make me look bad. Huh? Trying to make me look bad. Nah. I bet you 430. I bet you 30? That's what I'm saying. No. Exactly. Yeah, man, I told you y'all left me. Fucked up. Where's Pedro at? Yeah. Oh, yeah, no, he's going to be there. He's up there. I know, y'all left. I told y'all. Sorry, y'all. I started John on that. Get in the park. Hey, I'm on the Facebook. So Chris has intake, exhaust, no tune, same 392, and he made 433 horsepower, but 471 torque. So if we compare, I made 11 more horsepower, but 51 less torque. That's insane. So if anyone can answer why that happened, that would be great. <laughs> Oh well, I'm still happy with my numbers. Oh girl. Little sneaky 300. Alright, so I guess I can put these up. I don't need these anymore. Look, YouTube gear. So we got a red eye. I 
everybody's really excited about this. Seven oh nine. Seven oh nine. Seven oh nine, y'all. Seven oh nine. So even though we got a little wet out here, we're still able to do dino day. Of course, he starts his car right while I'm talking. But everybody's starting to roll out. We're about done. And this is all I ain't got all that baby So after seeing the numbers on that red eye and talking to even Bailey himself, that red eye is probably gonna put I didn't think this through. But this red eye is probably gonna hurt a lot of demon owners feelings man because uh those are some high numbers higher than demons what you do dodge all right guys man i hope y'all enjoyed the dfwlx dino day uh weather was all right guys i hope y'all enjoyed the dfwlx dino day i was able to record some good cars for you i got my buddies srta 300 with the 6 one head work, intake work, cam, long tubes, putting down, you know, 430 something. We got my car putting down 440 something. I got another comparison, you know, the Scat Pack 392 Charger, putting down 430 something. Uh, we have the wide body Hellcat that made 680 something. And then we had the Red Eye that just hurt some feelings, making 719, I think. Whew. Those are all good numbers, man. So, hope you guys enjoyed. It's cold. We're getting out of here. We're going to go get some Mexican food because I'm about to throw down on some kip, chips and queso. <laughs> but, if you like this video, man, hit that thumbs up. Subscribe. Hit that bell for notification. We got more things coming for my 300, of course. Might have some more things coming with another 300. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe I can talk my buddy into doing some stuff on his, trying to get some footage of his, because I know most of my followers, most subscribers are all 300 people. So stay tuned, man. We got some stuff, we got some good stuff coming. <laughs>